Welcome to the October 2021 edition of What's Happening Around Town for the City of San Bruno. I'm your host, Stephanie Tevis. I'm so glad you joined me. October is an interesting time here in San Bruno. The weather change is in the air, and yet we still have some nice days ahead of us. Here are some great ways you can take advantage of it. As you may be aware, California is experiencing a drought again. The city's water department has provided you with these tips to save this most precious resource. Water your lawn only two or three days a week. Replace your lawn with California native drought resistant plants. Rebates are available through the Lawn Be Gone program. Water during the cool part of the day. This is either before 8.30 a.m. or after 4.30 p.m. Use a broom to clean sidewalks and the pavement instead of a hose. Check with the city's water department's webpage for more water saving ideas. Join the San Bruno Public Library for another story time in Commodore Park, Tuesday, October 26th at a new time of 11 a.m. Enjoy great books, songs, and finger plays in an outdoor setting with the library staff. We will meet on the grass by the play structure, so you may want to bring a blanket or portable chairs to sit on. After story time, follow the brand new story walk signs, reading the picture book as you explore the park. Story walk signs will remain at Commodore Park until November 2nd. Commodore Park is located at Cherry and Commodore Avenue. Jumpstart your child's verbal skills in our introductory American Sign Language workshops. These classes are on Thursdays starting at 11 a.m. through December 16th. Learn and practice new vocabulary every class. These workshops are designed for babies from birth to 18 months and their caregivers. Since this class is on Zoom, you can invite other caregivers, like baby's grandparents, to join in. Register for Sign With Your Baby at programs.sanbrunolibrary.org for each Thursday session you would like to attend. Your favorite San Bruno librarians are presenting Zoom Storytime every Tuesday at 11 a.m. Find the next link at storytime.sanbrunolibrary.org. Don't miss out on our Pig Storytime with Real Live Pigs! Pig Storytime is airing on Thursday, October 21st at 11 a.m. Celebrate Dia de los Muertos with the San Bruno Library on Wednesday, October 20th. This will take place at the San Bruno Senior Center. All the details can be found at programs.sanbrunolibrary.org. Are you familiar with the book Good Night Moon? We will be having a story time called Good Night Sun on Monday, October 11th at 6.30 p.m. Depending on the weather, it will be held outside on the library patio. Join your favorite librarians to sing bedtime songs and hear stories as the sun sets over San Bruno. The San Bruno Library is offering Homework Center once again. For now, the Homework Center is by appointment only. Beginning on Monday, October 4th, the Homework Center will be held in the library's children's room. Go to kids.sanbrunolibrary.org for more information and to reserve your 45-minute session. In the city with a heart, your voice matters. To be heard and to help shape the future of policing in San Bruno, participate in our community survey at www.sanbruno.ca.gov forward slash IJ survey. Surveys are anonymous and will be analyzed by our partners at Impact Justice. Complete the survey and qualify to win a $100 Amazon gift card. Hey San Bruno, did you know that as of September 20th, 91.5% of the San Bruno community is vaccinated? If you haven't been vaccinated yet, there are options available and most do not require appointments. Visit myturn.ca.gov or call 833-422-4255 to find a convenient location near you. 
And if you have been vaccinated, you can get proof of vaccination electronically to conveniently carry with you at all times on your smartphone. Go to myvaccinerecord.ca.cdph.gov to learn how to download your electronic proof of vaccination card. Did you know that San Bruno is planning to move to district elections? The district formation process began with the city hosting its first public hearing on September 28th. The shift to district elections will replace the current at-large citywide elections where voters vote for all city council members. District formation will divide San Bruno into proportional districts and future elections will then be by-district elections where eligible voters may vote for one council member to represent their district. If you didn't get a chance to participate in the first public hearing on September 28th, you can always watch the recorded meeting on the city's website. All future meetings will be aired live on Channel 1, as well as posted to the city's website. Messages will be shared via social media. For more information on the districting process and to sign up to receive email updates, visit the new District Formation website at districting.com. SanBruno.org. Come celebrate Halloween by decorating your car and cruising down the Tanperan parking lot. The Jinx Joyride will take place on Thursday, October 28th from 5 until 8 p.m. Drive between Halloween themed displays occupied by spooky community partners and businesses who will delight you with their tricks and treats. Do you want to register? The cost is only $10 per car. Go to sanbruno.ca.gov forward slash rec sign up. The Jinx Joyride, only in San Bruno. The Senior Center is open and ready for you to join in on the fun. Know that parties will be limited to 120 people on a first come, first serve basis. So be ready to get here early to get a spot. Also, masks are required for anyone entering into the Senior Center. This policy is strictly enforced for everyone's safety. The Halloween dance party is on. On Friday, October 29th, Have a Party Pros will start the music at 10.30 a.m. Lunch will be ham Halloween and monster mashed potatoes. Dress up, dance, and eat, and of course, have fun. The reception desk has 120 tickets for this party. Sign up now and get ready to have a ghoulish good time. Ford vs. Ferrari is the free movie this month on Friday, October 22nd. Based on the remarkable true story about the Ford Motor Company's attempt to create the world's fastest car, Matt Damon and Christian Bale star in this movie version of the famous Le Mans 24-hour race that took place in 1960. Ford vs. Ferrari at 9.30 a.m. on Friday, October 22nd. The entire month of October is dedicated to better bones and posture. This is the name of the Pilates class offered on Tuesdays this month from 2 until 3 p.m. Stephanie Funk will lead you in safe and effective standing and mat exercises to form a foundation of bone-healthy movement. Improve your posture and balance increase your strength and flexibility to reduce your risk of falls. Pre-registration for this class is required. No drop-ins are allowed. Register online at www.fitnessmuse.com or contact Stephanie at 415-269-9772 or at the email address on your screen. You art lovers out there, come to the free Art Appreciation Lecture and Film with Linda Dever on Monday, October 18th. The use of pastels from the Renaissance to modern times is the topic of this class, which will begin at 1.30 in the afternoon. Are you ready to plan a Hawaiian cruise? The ship will set sail on March 27th, 2022. For details and to book your 15-day cruise, contact Marilyn Levine at 650-703-5522.
Do you have a San Bruno Cable email account with San Bruno CityNet services? Here are two changes that will impact your service. You now have the ability to change your email password within the webmail application. Click on Security Settings. Now enter your current password and the new password you want to use. If you need help, our customer service representatives are available to assist you in changing the password. The email password rules will be changing too, in order to ensure the security of your account. These new password rules took effect in September. It will not impact your current password. If you want to change your password, here are the requirements. Your password must be a minimum of eight characters. Besides alphanumeric characters, the password must have at least one number or special character, like a dollar sign. And you must have both upper and lowercase characters in the new password. If you have other questions about changing your current password, feel free to contact us at 616-3100 during regular office hours. It is almost time to fall back into standard time. This year, we set our clocks back one hour starting at 2 a.m. on Sunday, November 7th. This allows more light in the mornings during the winter time. It is also advisable to change out the batteries of your smoke detectors and carbon monoxide detectors twice a year. So if you do it when you adjust your clocks, you will be sure to always know the batteries will be fresh and your family will be safe. Speaking of smoke detectors and carbon monoxide detectors, have you thought about the true value of these simple devices? They can help to make a life-saving difference as well as prevent the potentially life-threatening impact of fire. Install smoke alarms and carbon monoxide detectors in every bedroom, outside each separate sleeping area, and on every level of the home. Interconnect all smoke alarms throughout the home. When one sounds, they all sound. Test alarms each month by pushing the test button. Replace all alarms when they are 10 years old or sooner if they do not respond properly. Make sure everyone in the home knows the sound and understands what to do when they hear the alarm. If we take these simple steps, we can be sure that these life-saving devices work when we need them the most. Thank you for joining me for another edition of What's Happening Around Town for the City of San Bruno. I'm Stephanie Tevis, wishing you a very happy Halloween.